alpha blockers, I plus or minus blockers, or I plus or minus adrenergic antagonists are pharmacological agents that act as receptor antagonists of I plus or minus adrenergic receptors. Classification I plus or minus 1 blockers or antagonists act at I plus or minus 1 adrenoceptors, I plus or minus 2 blockers or antagonists act at I plus or minus 2 adrenoceptors. When the term alpha blocker is used without further qualification, it sometimes refers to I plus or minus 1 blockers, and sometimes refers to agents that act at both types of receptors. Examples of non selective I plus or minus adrenergic blockers include phenoxabenzamine. Pentolamine, tolazolin, trazodone, typical and atypical antipsychotics. Selective I plus or minus one adrenergic blockers include alfuzosin, prazosin, tachazosin, tamsulosin, terazosin, silidosin. Selective I plus or minus two adrenergic blockers include actipamzole, idazoxin, mirtazapine, yohimbine. The agents carvedilol and labdilol are both I plus or minus and I squared blockers. Uses I plus or minus blockers are used in the treatment of several conditions, such as Raynaud's disease, hypertension, and scleroderma. I plus or minus blockers can also be used to treat anxiety and panic disorders, such as generalized anxiety disorder, panic disorder, or post traumatic stress disorder. While most commonly used to treat hypertension, they are also often used to treat the symptoms of BPH. Alpha-2 adrenergic receptor agonists, such as clonidine and guanfacine, act as noradrenergic autoreceptors to inhibit the firing of cells in the locus ceruleus, effectively reducing the release of brain norepinephrine. Clonidine has shown promise among patients with anxiety, panic and post-traumatic stress disorder also known as PTSD in clinical trials and was used to treat severely and chronically abused and neglected preschool children. It improved disturbed behavior by reducing aggression, impulsivity, emotional outbursts, and oppositionality. The following sleep disorders of insomnia along with the parasomnia disorders of nightmares and slash or night terrors also known as pava nocturnus were all reported to be reduced. Kinsey and Lung prescribed the combination of clonidine and imipram to severely traumatized Cambodian refugees with anxiety, panic and PTSD. Global symptoms of PTSD were reduced among 66% and nightmares among 77%. Guanfacine brand name Tenex produces less sedation than clonidine and thus may be better tolerated. Guanfacine reduced the trauma-related nightmares. A recently completed randomized double-blind trial among veteran patients with chronic PTSD showed that augmentation with guanfacine was associated with improvement in anxiety and PTSD. Prazosin also known as Maniprez is an alpha-1 receptor antagonist. Raskind and colleagues studied the efficacy of prazosin for PTSD among Vietnam combat veterans in a 20-week double-blind crossover protocol with a two-week drug washout to allow for return to baseline. The CAPS and the Clinical Global Impressions Change Scale were the primary outcome measures. Patients who were taking prazosin had a robust improvement in overall sleep quality and recurrent distressing dreams. In each of the PTSD symptom clusters the effect size was medium to large, 0.7 for re-experiencing or intrusion, 0.6 for avoidance and numbing, and 0.9 for hyperarousal. The reduction in CGIC scores also reflected a large effect size. Prazosin appears to have promise as an effective treatment for PTSD-related sleep disturbance, including trauma-related nightmares, as well as overall anxiety and PTSD symptoms. See also, beta blocker, references.